those attending the opening and the closing ceremony that is at shama prasad stadium from on 20th and 28th and coming from north and south goa except panaji are requested to come via nh17 and on reaching gms in bamboli take goa university road and come up to the function place point number 2 those coming from panaji may come to the function place via taligaon or dona pavala point number 3 the inox lane that is the general bernard gate road that is road leading to db mar from panaji market along inox complex will be closed near ccp market complex for entire period of 9 days car passes will be issued by esg indicating the category of the pass and respective parking lots the parking lots identified for the opening and closing ceremony are zone a1 parking inside dr shama prasad stadium zone a2 parking in the open space adjacent to dr shama prasad stadium near overhead water tank parking for the general public attending the opening and closing ceremony will be done in the open space near goa university cricket ground and in the open space near all india radio compound on other days during the festival period the vehicles with car pass only will be allowed to park in the service lane near inox theater and remaining vehicles can be parked at bandodkar football ground no vehicles will be allowed to be parked on db mark the motorists are requested to note the same and cooperate with the traffic police to ensure smooth flow of traffic in the city and the venues of the festival to make it an effective and a successful international film event for the uh, in- inaugural it is 320 from sp to the constable all ranks okay and uh, and Close. other days 191 191 Where are you getting them from? Is it a traffic cell? Is it? We we have a shortage, no doubt. We have drawn from all units. There are other units, side branches. Uh, central pool has been formed. From there we are drawing, and that is how we are making the making up the shortage. This being an international event. even otherwise events of great and important magnitude staff is drawn from all over there are people working in administration branches also those are being drawn so there during these days they will be operating at skeletal uh, skeletal arrangements will be there normal clerical staff will be there police personnel who supplement them they will be drawn for this from all over sp south has sp north has the offices are there police headquarters there are staff who supplement the clerical staff they are all being withdrawn I that know. is how we will but for like you say shortages we cannot draw them for all days to put them on the road and all that will get solved only through recruitment but then there are retirements also so it is a process long process so to make up for short term we do this so what is the plan for entire november december because lot of events november december leave has been banned those instructions have gone for the time being leave has been banned till the end of this month and maybe st francis xavier feast that is on the 3rd because staff will be deployed for all this skeletal arrangements will be there in the sp in the administration branches but that will not mean that the clerical staff will be drawn police personnel will be drawn to make up the shortfall then again you have the december month there also depending on the uh, for example christmas week and all there are a lot of tourist footfalls say from 18 19th onwards that time again staff will be withdrawn leave also will be will not be granted only in emergent cases emergencies and all then leave will be granted but enforcement how 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 does enforcement happen in this case because lot of your staff see will you have to will the stick also you have to be polite as well N- so 